significant song of social protest you can dance to. Don't talk shit, Sting. This is the best Fallout song ever. Your hair, your hair is I need a bag of ball anyway. Oh, I need a grind a bowl. But I saw, I saw when you came back to me that it had cleared up your skin. So, whoa, 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 You're hot. <laughs> You're my radiation, baby. You're my All right, we'll smoke a good indica. Make sure I don't do the dishes this afternoon. Wee. And next is a song for next. I'll grind this up. Oh, I got to turn this one up a little bit. <laughs> All right, let me get this loaded. We're going to fire up. We're playing Fallout 1 today, this afternoon. We're taking a look at it, see how far we get. I've only been in the first cave for about 10 minutes. You can get down with the old music sting, hell yeah. All right. I don't think they have it in this one, though. I may have to, if we play this, <coughs> for any length of time, <laughs> put together that actual like, YouTube playlist for it. <coughs> 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 Alright. Oh, there's only got 30 seconds left of the song. I'll let him finish it up. No, we'll fire up the game. <coughs> but this is the 1997 Fallout we're going to be playing. Is it 97, 98? 97, I think. Fallout 1. Wrap this shit up, dude. You know, we know you're gonna lock yourself away from that chick. The crazy one. I tell you what, Twitch didn't want to let me go live today. Twitch has been kind of retarded yesterday and today. 
I want to say this is from 1997, dude. I was still in high school. It should... It should... There we go. I'm not going to touch anything. Interplay. Gamers. by gamers. For gamers. by gamers. Brian Fargo presents. At least I didn't start streaming without streaming again. <laughs> Maybe you'll think of me. Our dedicated boys keep the peace in newly annexed Canada. <laughs> That's how we keep the peace here, motherfuckers. Maybe the one who is waiting for you will We do have a widescreen texture uh mod running once we get into the game sting. Only hundred and ninety-nine thousand or two hundred thousand dollars. Or I wonder if that's caps. That Mr. Handy walks the dog. changes. The Romans waged war to gather slaves and wealth. Spain built an empire from its lust for gold and territory. Hitler shaped a battered Germany into an economic superpower. But war never changes. In the 21st century, war was still waged over the resources that could be acquired. Only this time, the spoils of war were also its weapons. Petroleum and uranium. For these resources, China would invade Alaska. China and Alaska. Oh yeah. Canada, and the European Commonwealth would dissolve into quarreling, bickering nation states, bent on controlling the last remaining resources on Earth. In 2077, the storm of world war had come again. In two brief hours, most of the planet was reduced to cinders, and from the ashes of nuclear devastation a new civilization would struggle to arise. A few were able to reach the relative safety. Yeah, that's in part three's DLC, Sting. Your family was part of that group. That Operation Anchorage, I think is what it's called. <clears throat> Imprisoned safely behind the large vault door under a mountain of stone, a generation has lived without knowledge of the outside world. Life in the vault is about to change. Dun, dun, dun. All right, let's see. I've never actually sat and listened to that whole cutscene before. Just kind of got into the game, messed around with it to see what we could do. I wanted to save all that for while we're streaming. So, new game. Do we want to be vid? Let's see. Stone to his friends. Maxwell is the largest person currently living in the vault. He is known for his physical strength and stamina. He would make the ideal volunteer due to his tremendous size and strength. It is unfortunate that his intelligence was affected after birth uh, when the labor bot dropped him on his head. <laughs> he doesn't care that he might have to leave the vault. Who else do we have? Natalia. Natalia is the grandchild of a Russian diplomat who worked at the Soviet consulate in Los Angeles. She is a talented acrobat with excellent coordination and reflexes. Extremely intelligent and resourceful. Her only difficulty as a young child was understanding personal property laws. Natalia is very interested in leaving the vault and curious to explore the outside world. Or Albert. Albert is a charismatic leader of a small vocal minority of the vault population that is considered life on the outside world. Dedicated to the role of negotiator, he is often able to communicate efficiently between different partners. Parties. Ooh. His uh, professed occupation is closest to what uh, was once known as a lawyer. Oh. 
Albert is often able to convince others that his ideas are correct. Oh, we only get Max, Albert, and Natalia. Let's do Albert. Let's do the lawyer. We can modify him and go in and change all their attributes. Um... We'll leave that. I'm just going to leave that where we're at. Small guns, speech, barter. See what we can do. Done. Ah, you're here. Good. We've got a problem. A big one. The controller chip for our water purification system has given up the ghost. Can't make another one. The process is too complicated for a workaround system. Simply put, we're running out of drinking water. No more drinking water! No water, no vault. Albert Einstein, that's right, Sting. crucial to our survival. And frankly, I, I think you're the only hope we have. Uh-oh. to go find us another controller chip. We estimate we have four to five months before the vault runs out of water. We need that chip. Marked your map with the location of another vault. <coughs> Not Great. a bad place to start, I think. Look, just be safe. Okay. I'll be safe ish. Right? The graphics in this are like, what the fuck? But it's still great! This is where it all started. Before Bethesda. Oh shit, my phone's on my desk over there vibrating. Give me one second. Alright. This was some advanced shit for 97, right? Can you see why people liked it? Okay. So this is... <laughs> this is what we've got. So, for those of you that weren't aware, it's an isometric. Uh, this is with the HD graphic upgrade, and we're running the widescreen mod. So, first thing, inventory. Like I said, I've messed around with this just a slight bit, so I have an idea of what to do. You know, I don't have any armor. So... There was... I forget how to do any of this. And then we got rats! So now we can shoot them with our pistol. <laughs> We're killing. Right, Sting? This is the HD graphic update. With the patches, the high-res patches, and everything. Okay, for defeating your enemies, you earn 25 experience points. Cool. But now we got all kinds of rats. If I can come down here and just get the one over here. Hey, Goliath Gaming from Twitter. What's going on, man? How are you? And I... I don't know how to just make him, like, aim at that and get the first shot. Smoke weed.